Namaste friends, welcome to Learn with J, empowered by Magic Needles. This day I am here with a peacock stitch or it can also be called as peacock fan stitch and this stitch uses clusters or groups of treble crochets worked in a single stitch. Okay, and it's this pattern is a two row repeat and uh, the SC row and uh, the two treble row that is SC two treble row is the uh, back wrong side and your fan row is your right side okay to I have made this sample with brick red hobby store Aaron 100% premium acrylic antique pill yarn with color code 2046 and its weight is medium 4 and uh, it's a 5 ply yarn and I am using a 5.5 mm clover amor hook okay so I shall make uh, it requires a multiples of 10 plus <clears throat> one plus one as a foundation chain so that is what it was given in the pattern otherwise it's 10 multiples of 10 plus two chains as a starting foundation chains so i shall make the required number of chains and get back to you i have made uh, multiples of 10 in that is two multiples of 10 plus two chains extra <clears throat> as a foundation chains now single crochet in the second stitch from the hook a second chain from the hook then skip four and make nine trebles in the fifth one for treble yarn over twice one two three four and in the fifth one <coughs> make nine trebles all in the same stitch <coughs> This is in US terminology. Don't worry if it is curling, it will straighten out the pattern. <coughs> so, nine trebles done in the fifth one, and then skip next, skip four stitches. So, the one next to the chain where we made five will be hidden, so you should count. Don't forget to count it one, two, three, four, and in the fifth, you make a single crochet. again skip four nine trebles in the fifth chain from this point that is skipping four one two three four and nine trebles i shall make nine trebles in the stitch and get back to you <coughs> i have placed the nine trebles in this chain now skip four i'll be i ideally left with five one two three four five so skip four and make the single crochet in the last stitch here So now chain 4 or a standing treble whichever is convenient you can do let me try out my standing treble pull up the loop to the height of a treble turn your work and you need to twist it twice even if you twist it one you should be careful enough to place the required number of stitches to get the height of the treble so let me switch twist once <coughs> insert in the SC yarn over pull through the loop from behind this loop first loop on the crochet hook and behind this again you will have two loops on the hook yarn over pull through this and behind the second loop so I have made one two and this is the final third uh, stitch in the treble <coughs> standing treble and then one more place one treble again in the same stitch so you begin with two trebles and then <coughs> otherwise chain four and one treble then chain three 
so this is the wrong side row skip four dc's one two three four that is the fifth one that is the middle one of the nine uh, dc group make one single crochet again chain three place two trebles in the single crochet between the two sets of nine dc's here one treble done the second treble <coughs> how to make the treble there is a separate video available in this uh, channel so you can refer to that so again chain three sorry a single crochet in the fifth one two three four fifth dc here so it's all drawn one two three four five chain three and two treble in the SC here chain 1 and turn SC in between the two trebles we did in the last row and then 9 trebles in the SC on top of this 9 DC group that is the peacock fan group so in this stitch we are going to make 9 trebles So place nine trebles. I shall place nine trebles and get back to you. So single crochet between the two trebles. Again, nine trebles in the SC on top of the fifth treble we had done in the last row. Your nine treble group row is the right side row. This is a beautiful pattern. You can use it for your <coughs> decorative pieces. You can use it for baby baby dresses. You can use it for your tops. Especially the summer tops will look good. And if you want a stole, you can make your stoles with this. This pattern is a versatile pattern. It may eat up a little bit of yarn. But it's a beautiful stitch. So let me make nine DCs and get back nine trebles and get back to you. Come to the end of this row here. Now place a single crochet between the treble and the first treble we made between two trebles. I made two trebles here. If you had made the turning chain, it should be between the turning chain and the trebles. So again, <coughs> we have placed a single crochet. The next row is again row two, which is Two trebles, chain three, single crochet, or chain four and a treble in the set C. Chain three, single crochet in the fifth DC of the nine DC group. No, sorry, fifth uh, treble of the nine treble group. One, two, three, four, five here. Again, chain three, two trebles in the single crochet here. This pattern sits over one another, it's not staggered. The peacock fan sits over the one below. <coughs> chain three again, one, two, three, four, and the fifth one. Sorry, two and in the SC here you are making two trebles. So only the single crochets you, you work between the trebles, but the trebles you place in the single crochet. So this is how it will look. The 
complete that the completed swatch is here. The swatch looks like this. This is the right side. You can end it up uh, end up the pattern with row two. It looks beautiful. And you can make small squares and join them as you like and as you go. Also, that also will create a very beautiful pattern. I think you would have enjoyed this uh, small uh, video with this pattern. Do subscribe to Magic English channel. Do not forget to hit on the bell icon so that you are notified of the videos that we upload. <coughs> and I shall be back with yet another pattern in the next video. Bye for now.